Warning, the following program contains scenes of graphic stupidity between a man and some games. Don't take anything Android say too serious, I'm just messing around. This video should not be viewed by anyone. How's it going everybody? Today we are going to be checking out Survival Fountain of Youth. Now before we jump in the game, I want to say that this is a demo for the game and it is part of the next fest event over on Steam. But the game, it did not feel like a demo. It's a free to play demo, anybody can try it out over on Steam. But the game, it felt real polished, it worked very well and it is actually a very good game. It surprised me, it really surprised me just how good of a survival game it is. Now, as I have said, it is a survival game and it is set in an open world. We play as a stranded 16th century explorer and we are part of Ponce de Leon's crew and our ship gets caught in a storm and we are stranded on this island. As we know, Ponce de Leon went around looking for the Fountain of Youth. So, as we were trying to look for that, the ship got caught in a storm and the ship got destroyed. And we get stranded on this island but we're not confided to this one island because we can go between islands we can craft a raft a ship whatever and go in between islands and we have to survive on these islands there are of course dangerous animals weather plants diseases injuries hunger and thirst exhaustions everything will be against us pretty much and we're gonna try and survive there we have to stay alive we have to hunt we have to fight explore check out new territories, map out the islands, gather resources, we can go fishing, we can craft, cook, build, it's, there's a lot, a lot of things that we can do, we have skills, it's, and this was just in the demo, <laughs> we can also dive underwater and, and fight sharks and things like that, it is a very extensive game and today I've barely scratched the surface of it, now right before the ship sank, I actually managed to grab a couple of things from my cabin, a map, and I managed to grab a backpack and an axe from a chest. There was a chest with a couple of different things that could, and we could only pick two things. So I picked the backpack and the axe from the chest and then I leaped out the window of the, of the ship out into the water and we pick up as I awaken on the beach. Alright, and here we are on the beach. We're on an island, on a beach, and this is what remains of our ship. Good lord. Now our first objective is to find a green coconut. Now I have this axe, and I also have this backpack. I managed to grab this from a chest as we were fleeing the sinking ship. I could choose from a couple of different things. I chose the backpack, and I chose this here iron axe. But we have sun, rain, freezing, wind, armor, overheating. We have food, water, energy, alright, we have a bunch of things, status as well. Alright, so we have to find a green coconut, which I do believe that this is it right here. Alright, Co craft coconut water, oh, there's another one. Alright, so if we go here, we can press F, that brings out the blueprints, and we can make... Or craft some coconut water. So we can split the coconut in two pretty much. And then we can eat this. There we go. Raise food value to 50%. So we have to find food. You reckon there's going to be any resources left from, from the ship? Let me see here. Any crates? Any... Here we go. Loaf of bread. That's nice. There we go. Now we have water. Wait, we had some water. We we had some bread as well, but we ate it. Now we have to gather narrow leaves and build ourselves something. A place to sleep, I believe it said. Oh, stick. Narrow leaves. What does that mean? Can I cut this down? Interaction. Narrow leaves and yellow leaves. Okay, narrow leaves is what we need. And with these narrow leaves, we can build a primitive bed of leaves. Alright, so if we press tab, we go to crafting. We can go to buildings, and here we have a primitive bed of leaves. So we can place this. I'll place it here in the shade. Oh, hold on. E. There we go. And then, it says that it's a primitive place to sleep. Does not protect against external effects. Does not grant any health bonuses. Base restore rate is 4 energy per hour of sleep. Alright, let's place this down here. Place all resources. Oh, I need 5 of these. Oh, gotcha, gotcha. 
We need five leaves. There we go. I have all five leaves, so we can now place all the resources and build one hour. All right. Check it out. A bed. Sleep for six hours or more. We're going straight up to bed. We're on a strange island in the Caribbean. Car the islands. Car Caribbean? Car Caribbean? Something like that. <laughs> Alright, I guess we're sleeping for six hours. Ah. Build a signal fire. Alright, how do we do that? Uh, is that in buildings? It's not in buildings. Campfire. I have a campfire. Oh, smoke signal. Is this it? We need yellow leaves and we need small sticks. All right, let me place this. I guess we'll place it over here. There we go. And we need some sticks and we need we need some yellow, some yellow leaves. Oh, what's happening? Partially cloudy. Oh, the weather. Nice. I think these are the yellow ones, right? I'll pick some of these up as well. Maybe we'll need them later. There we go. There we go. And I need sticks. How do we get sticks? Can we craft? Craft? No. Cut down. Can we cut down some trees? Are there sticks here? There are not. Narrow leaves. Some of these leaves. So it actually takes time to, to gather the leaves and whatnot. And that's why it's already night time. We also slept half the day. <laughs> we slept like six hours. All right, here we go. These are steaks. We can harvest them. I don't remember how many we needed, but we're gonna find out in just a quick second here. Oh, look at that. I have some sort of a buff, a green buff. What does that mean? What is this? Oh, a vivacy. And I'm also sunburned. Uh, how did this happen? Take medicine, tobacco, compress. Did I stay in the sun for too long? Did I sleep in the sun? I thought it was shade there. All right, and here is our smoke signal. Oh, it's green. Nice. Oh, this is so we can see our camp, probably. All right, create a stone cutter. A stone knife? Let me see here. Tools. Which one is... Okay, here we go. Tools. Stone cutter. What about that? Craft. Nice. New goal, find the survivors. You reckon there's going to be any survivors? Find the picture grotto. Oh, so this is a picture that we found in our ship. And it's, um, well, it's this. So we have to find this, um, this cave. Now it's by, or not by, but as soon as we hit some, some bones, I'm assuming some whale bones or something. Past the bones, there's a cave. Now there's also a big mountain behind the cave. So if we look around here. Let me see. So if we look... At, oh, there you go. Here we go. So this is a big mountain. And it's got that little rock on the top. So it's going to be... I guess down the beach, I'm presuming. This way. Should we... Should we like try and find some more food? Some. Can I grab some coconuts? Oh, here we go. Thank you very much. I can actually pick this up. And I believe if we can go over here. Ripe coconut. This one, if I'm not mistaken, is going to give us some... Uh... Let me see here. Let me see. Let me see. So if we... Yeah, yeah it's going to give us some food. So I can actually eat this one. And the green ones give gives us water. Alright, so I'm going to actually head this way. I'm going to take advantage of the night time so I don't get sunburned again. We have crabs, we have turtle, a very fast turtle, look at it go! <laughs> what are these? Uh, coconut shells, alright, gotcha, gotcha. So do I have the... oh, I do. There we go. Alright, so I'm presuming... So it's either that way or it's this way, but I'm gonna go this way because it seems to be more open. And we're gonna see if we can find anything on the beach, so if we see some bones... We know that we're close by to the to the cave. And we have to find the cave and see if there's any survivors. From what I'm gathering. Some more of these. 
So can we craft the... We, so we can just gather the leaves with our bare hands. We don't need an actual tool. And there we go. Should I craft like some clothes or something? Can we craft clothes? Equipment. Here we go. So we can craft the leaf cape. Oh, we have enough of these. Alright, let's craft that. Oh, chance of injury 21%. 1% base and dark 20. Oh, if I make it in the dark. Wait, if I make it in the dark, the chance of injury goes up. That's interesting. Hopefully I can swim as well. I mean, I gotta be able to swim, right? Oh yeah, we can swim, we can swim. Some shark is gonna light me up. <laughs> We're just gonna do, we're just gonna, oh, here we go. We're just gonna explore a little bit today, and we're, we're gonna see what we can see. Is that a ship back there, or is that an island? Like, right over there, right there. We're gonna see what we can find. I'm, I'm probably not gonna do very well on my first run here, but I'll, I'll try my best. We got some shells. We're probably gonna be able to eat these. Let me see here. So we can get this, it's edible, it gives us, it restores 8 food and 4 water, but we have a chance of indigestion, 10%. Indigestion, Indi is that how, yeah, I think so, indigestion. Alright, this island seems to be quite big. Look at that, I want to go there so bad. <laughs> Look how cool that looks, and there's my smoke signal, jeez. That's definitely so we can see where our camp is. Wait, is this the cave? Oh, blood! What is that? Whoa, 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 whoa! The flip are you? Some sort of a skunk? Can I harvest this? No resources. We cannot harvest it. Okay. To this axe? No way! Leave me alone, you skunk! Oh, this is the grotto, isn't it? I swear. Leave me alone. It's so dark. Obsidian deposit. This is not... This is not it. It's not it. It's not it. I just got... I just got attacked by that skunk. That skunk just came at me. Oh my god, what is... What is this? Completely wet. What? Oh, because I swam. Right, I went swimming earlier. Oh, I think this may be it, actually. Hold on, let me look around. Not this way. Oh, my God. <gasps> oh, food. Chance of injury, 20%. I'll just take it, man. I gotta take it because I gotta I gotta cook some meat. It's just 20%, so it, it, chances are we're not gonna get all that injured. Oh, look at the... The sun coming up, finally. Oh, come on. Come on. Got him. Dude, I'm glad that I picked this axe. <laughs> this axe is very good. What? <laughs> the eagle. The eagle just came at me. What the... Look at him going, go! Go be with your people in the water! The bloody eagle just came at me! My god! I hear a chicken as well. Alright, so I have not found the cave, but it looks like there's some sort of a structure here. So I'm guessing we may not be alone on this island, or somebody was here at some point. I'm gonna quickly take a look around and see if I can find anything. Then we'll continue on our way. We can keep going that way. Oh, it's a basket. It's an empty basket. Oh, that's it? Alright. I was hoping that this was it, but it doesn't look like... Oh, is that apples? It doesn't look like this is the grotto that we're looking for. This is apples, isn't it? Oh, is it not apple? I, oh, here we go. Interact. And we have... Oh, it's oranges. 
Now we have some food. Hell yeah. There's a bunch of them as well. Oh, we're not gonna suffer now. We got food. Oranges are delicious. I'm actually gonna eat some of them right now. And I'm gonna eat one. I'm gonna eat two. They don't give a lot of hunger saturation, but it's better than nothing. Oh! Top. Flip, flip! Oh. Just wreck myself. <laughs> Alright. Oh, I left the beach, by the way. I, I kind of got distracted. Is that a big drawing up there? Is that like a... Wait a minute. Look at that thing over there. Right there. Oh my god, no, don't throw it. How do I not throw it? Oh my god. Give me back. <laughs> Alright, so you can throw this as well. I didn't know that. <laughs> I don't want to... What? What? What the? What is wrong with these eagles? Get lost! Stupid eagle. Alright, give me your feathers. I'm gonna make some arrows out of them. Hopefully I can build a bow. Oh my god, I'm, I'm all bloodied up. Can I make a bow and arrow? I don't know where melee weapon is. It's not melee, right? This has to be ranged. Maybe we cannot do it yet. Whoa! Whoa, look at- Oh, that's like a nice little oasis over there. Not oasis, because we're not in the desert. But you know what I mean. It's like a nice spot over there, which we're gonna check. What's happening? Ease does it. We're definitely gonna be able to make a bow and arrow. But I guess later on. It's a huge, like, drawing up there, I'm guessing. We have to go there. Oh, check it out. Living water. Oh, that's like heels. That's heels. Oh my god, no way. Dog. Not wolf, I mean. No. This is where we die. We're gonna get eaten by the wildlife. It's coming. It's coming. This is it. We're screwed. This is a bad spot. Why did we come here? This is where we're supposed to find a cave. Climb. Oh, you best be joking. All right, I'm... Uh, <laughs> no. Stupid. Get out of here. Alright, I really want to leave right now. Oh, the water. Give me the water. This. Uh, use. There we go. That charged my health up. Alright, we were supposed to stay by the beach and try and find this damn cave. Turns out I got distracted and we didn't find the cave. But, I did get absolutely wrecked by a bunch of uh, wildlife. Alright, so I did find the Skeletron. And there seems to be something here as well. Indian hunting drawing. Bow, spear. Okay. Oh, is this how I'm learning to... To craft new things. And I think that's the cave right there. Have I learned how to make like a bow and... And spears and something like that? I hope so. Alright, so I think this is the cave. It took me longer than I expected to find it. Because I did in fact walk past it. <laughs> but I did find it. it. Looks to be very dark. I don't have a torch, so apologies about that. And it's filled with scorpions. I oh god, is that potatoes? Oh no, that's a mushroom. Is this? Are we cool? What do I do to the scorpion? Is this not it? Oh, this is it. Nice. Our captain, Juan Ponce de Leon, also survived the shipwreck. 
Sea currents brought him to this same island just a bit earlier before my awakening. Right, so we are part of the crew of Sir Ponce de Leon. He located the grotto and made it his temporary shelter. Then he started to act quickly and decisively. After building up the temporary camp, the captain began to explore the island. He named it the Island of Hope. During his trip to the small nearby island, he heard distant cannon shots. It was a signal from one of our ships. The captain left a note, then hurriedly packed and sailed towards the sound of the gunshots. He was in a hurry to help his team. In this hurry, he forgot his spyglass on the small island. It can be quite useful to me. All right, here we go. I'm not gonna read this because it's way too long, but I will pick up the heel. Thank you very much. And he said that he left a spyglass, but I don't see it because it's very dark. There is a fire back there. Wait, do I have the spyglass? Doesn't look like it. Oh, did he leave it outside or something? It's so dark in here. There's so many scorpions. Nope. Bro! Oh, this is a campfire. No suitable fire start. I don't have a fire starter. Cook food and campfire. How do I make the food? Where did he leave his spyglass? Was it on the rocks? Damn it, dude. He was like sitting somewhere and he left it. Alright, but we're gonna stop for right now. We're gonna pick up next time. We're gonna try and make a fire, cook some meats. We got some meats from the from the birds and whatnot and some eggs and we have some fruit. We're gonna stop for right now. I hope everybody enjoyed. I'm having a lot of fun playing this game. It's actually very surprising and it's very good. And it's just a demo as well, so it's just the beginning. It, it stands to be improved and expanded and there's there's like a bunch of things here, including our character. These are uh, these are kind of our skills, so we can we can improve them by doing certain things. For example, I already have three strength by running around and one athletics and things like that. We have this as well, concentration and diseases and a bunch, a bunch of things. We just barely scratched the surface, but we're gonna stop for right now. I hope everybody enjoyed. In case you did, be sure to drop some stuff and things down below. Make sure to subscribe. Thank you so much for taking the time and hanging out, and I will see you in the next one with some more video games.